Zhou Sun is one of the most critically and commercially successful Chinese actresses best known for films like Perhaps Love and Balzac and The Little Chinese Seamstress. She has ruled the film and TV industry in China for over two decades. She ventured into showbiz in the early 1990s with films and then forayed into TV. The first TV series that garnered her recognition was Palace of Desire while her breakthrough film was Suza River. The latter brought her widespread fame and won her Best Actress Award at the 15th Festival du Film de Paris. Considered as one of the four Dan actresses in China, Zhou's rich body of work includes several successful national and international films as well as TV series. These include films like Suza River, Balzac, and The Little Chinese Seamstress, Painted Skin and Painted Skin, The Resurrection and notable TV series like The Legend of the Condor Heroes and Red Sorghum among others. She also dedicates herself in social service which has earned her several recognitions including being named as the first United Nations Development Program, UNDP, Goodwill Ambassador for China in 2008. Childhood and Early Life Zhou Sun was born on October 18, 1974 in Kuzhu, Zhejiang in the middle-class family of Zhou Tianning and Chen Yukin. Her father was a local film projectionist while her mother worked in a department store as a salesperson. She studied at the Kuzhu No. 1 Middle School. Although her parents wanted her to pursue graduation from a university, but due her passion for dramatic arts, she enrolled at the Zhejiang Arts Institute. Career Her acting debut happened in the early 1990s with films like Old Grave, 1991, The Pampered Wife, 1995, and Temptress Moon, 1996, among others. She forayed into television with the 1997 series Hong Chu Fang which was followed by a few others until she earned her first notable role of young princess Taiping in the Chinese television historical series Palace of Desire. It earned her audience's choice for actress and best supporting actress awards that year at the 18th China TV Golden Eagle Award. The 2000 film Suza River, written and directed by Liu Ye turned out to be her breakthrough film on the big screen. In the film she played dual roles of Mei Mei and Mao Dan and it was well received abroad. It not only garnered her international recognition but also won her Best Actress Award at the 15th Festival du Film de Paris. In 2000, she along with Su Jing Lea's, Zhao Wei and Zhang Ziyi was named as the four Dan actresses, which means that these divas were considered mainland China's four most bankable young actresses. Moving on with other films like Beijing Bicycle, 2001, and TV series like April Rhapsody, 2000, and Love Story in Shanghai, 2001, she landed up with her first Hong Kong flick Hollywood Hong Kong. This Fruit Chan directed 2001 film that released in 11 countries including in the US, South Korea, Singapore and Italy earned her critical acclaim. She also appeared in Dai Sija directed Franco-Chinese romance drama film Balzac and the Little Chinese Seamstress. The film was based on Sija's 2000 semi-autobiographical novel bearing same title and premiered at the 55th Con Film Festival on May 16, 2002. While continuing with other noteworthy films and TV series, she earned the role of Sun N.A. in the Hong Kong musical film Perhaps Love. Although this 2005 film failed at the box office, it closed the 2005 Venice Film Festival and was submitted as an official entry by Hong Kong at the 78th Academy Awards Ceremony in 2006. Directed by Peter Chan, Perhaps Love garnered Joe huge critical acclaim and won her Best Actress Awards at the Golden Horse Awards, Golden Bauhinia Awards, Hong Kong Film Critics Society Award and Hong Kong Film Awards. She continued her success in notable films like The Banquet, 2006, Ming Ming, 2007, and The Equation of Love and Death, 2008, with the latter fetching her Best Actress Awards at the Chinese Film Media Awards, Asian Film Awards, Golden Rooster Film Festival and Shanghai Film Critics Awards. With time her power-packed versatile performances complemented with success of her films made her one of the top most and sought-after actresses of China while the audience tagged her angel in the world. Her next film was a supernatural fantasy titled Painted Love that released on September 25, 2008, in Hong Kong and the following day in China, created a new milestone in Chinese films. She was honored as the Asian Star of the Year by Asia Pacific Producers Network, APN, in 2009 for achieving such box office feats. She was also picked up as the Star of the Year at Cine Asia Exhibition and Distribution Convention held in Hong Kong. Basking with success as an actress, she endeavored into direction with the 2011 short film Five Demon Traps. It had Tony Leung Chu Wei playing a demon killer. She was formally named a new ambassador for Chanel the same year. Jo featured in yet another notable film of her career with the 2012 sequel of Painted Skin, titled Painted Skin. The Resurrection. 
The film where she reprised her role of Xiao Wei grossed more than 700 million yuan at the box office, making it the top-grossing Chinese-language film ever. In 2012, Jo made her Hollywood debut in the science fiction film Cloud Atlas, playing multiple roles in the film. The film grossed over the 700 million yuan, $109.8 million, landmark, becoming the highest-grossing Chinese-language movie of all time then. In 2014, Jo returned to television after 10 years in Red Sorghum, based on Nobel Prize laureate M.O. Yan's 1986-1987 novel of the same name. Joe's performance in the series was highly praised by the author himself for her immaculate grasp of the character's inner turmoil. Joe won the Best Actress Award at the Asian Television Award. In 2018 she starred in the romance film Last Letter directed by Shunji Iwei, and was nominated for the Best Actress Award at the Golden Horse Awards. In 2019, Joe starred in the crime thriller film Remain Silent. In 2021, Joe starred in fantasy film The Yuniang Master. Zhou is set to star in the Wuxia film The Weary Poet, and family drama film The Eleventh Chapter. French Foreign Minister Laurent Fabius bestowed upon her Chevalier Medal in the Order of Arts and Letters in 2014 in recognition of her contribution to film, public welfare and Sino-French communications. Her pursuits as a singer include her albums such as Summer, 2003, and Come Across, 2005, and contributing to soundtracks of films like Bayober in Love, 2004, and Perhaps Love, 2005, among others. Personal Life On July 16, 2014, she married American actor Archie Kao. They tied the knot on stage following a charity show in Hangzhou, China. On December 23, 2020, Zhou announced on her Sina Weibo account that they have divorced. She is a citizen of Hong Kong under the Equality Migrant Admission Scheme. Zhou is involved in social work that has brought her several recognitions. In 2008 she was made the first United Nations Development Program, UNDP, Goodwill Ambassador for China. She is the first entertainer across the globe who became the laureate of Champions of the Earth, Inspiration and Action, of United Nations Environment Program, UNEP, in 2010. The World Economic Forum honored her as one of the 2011 Young Global Leaders.